Okay, you question on the therapeutic pulse. Um, uh, Dr. Jones developed in osteopathy the technique called strain counter strain, right? He developed it because he had a patient that nobody knew how to treat. He says, oh, we're gonna treat him. He tried everything and the patient still had his low back pain. He didn't know what to do and he says, oh, at least I'm gonna put him in a comfortable position. And he put him in a position when he can find some kind of comfort, avoiding pain. And the phone ring, supposedly, or he wanted to see another patient. And the patient was in a special position and he was sleeping and you wake him up and the pain was gone. So the connection of position, sometimes it's called positional release therapy, the position of the patient can release some of his lesion, muscle spasm. And over the years, he's developed a specific technique where he was identifying tender point, tender point, not trigger point, the tender point that were potential uh, trigger point, the tender point where he could press, feel pain, and depending where the tender point are located, he is going to find a position to release the problem. Just to tell you that those tender points sometimes pulse. You feel a therapeutic pulse. So that's an old, old concept in osteopathy. And during the release, you're gonna feel a therapeutic pulse. It's just to tell you that there's something happening, okay? So the way I take it for me is I know the way hearts will believe if you compress them for a while, they're gonna f f uh, they don't like it. And they're gonna fight you back and they're going to pulse for a while. And if you, if you compress them too much, nothing is happening. But if you compress them just enough, you're gonna have this pulse fighting you. And if you have a release somewhere, during the release, you're gonna decompress those arteries a little bit, and they're gonna pulse for a while. He's just telling you there's a release happening until they stop beating. So when you have a therapeutic pulse for me, it's one indicator that you have a release, decompression of an artery, but you use it with all the other indicators you have, that the fascia is releasing, the tension is releasing, and, um, and that's what you can do with it. So if you feel it, it's great to give you some indication. There's a, a release, you're doing something in, in, the, in the right direction. If you don't feel it, use other indicators, you know, fascia tension, the fluid uh, circulation. And uh, that, that's my take on it, all right? Thank you.